we're about ready to go here at the Coliseum. Caden Primo gets the call for the Rocket. And at the other end of the ice, Joseph Wallen. What more can we say about him and how well he's played? The last time he saw Laval here at home, he faced 58 shots, only let in two and got the win in that effort as well. It's been the Montreal, or the Laval penalty kill, though, that has been struggling. But you can see that here, 26.8%, 24%, two very good, very high-powered power plays facing off. Steves on the backhand, scores! A silent rattlesnake strikes for Alex Steves. Just a minute 36 in on the power play. Moving the puck around, Godet. Coming back to it, he and Clifford trying to force it back to the goal. Up the right side it comes. Feeling it. Drops it back. Simono just getting it over. Got at the shot. Lose out front. It scores. Abandonado has that one pop by Joseph Wall to tie it up. Landisi. Petronero carries it up down the left wing. Landisi with him, takes the shot himself as he sent it high. And now Landisi cross sights. Petronero side of the goal, scores! Mikhail Abramov takes it in. And the Marlies with 51 seconds left to go, go up 2 1. And it is hard off the glass and in. Rafai. Trying to get that pick up along the boards. Steps out into some dangerous territory, but he fights his way back through. And now four on two back the other way. Rafai looks, shoots, rebound, scores! No rebound, it slides past Primo. Marshall Rafai with the power shot. They keep the zone alive as they step back to it. Picked up and lifted out by Dryden Hunt. In front for Blandisi, turns around, gives it to Steves, who takes the 8-15 into the city. Alex Steves with his second goal of the hockey game, his 16th of the year. Knocked down by Trudeau, five seconds left to go. That's going to do it. Last shot comes from the penalty kill crew of the Toronto Marlies, and Joseph Wall picks up the win. Another one, another one, as uh, the Marlies come away with a 4-1 victory with a strong late third period.